some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we've got a California softard who attempts the right to travel argument with a CHP officer, but it doesn't work out too well for him because the officer is just not buying into the BS. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. I don't know how many of you have seen the channel just rolled in. It is essentially a channel about what mechanics have to deal with on a daily basis. Uh, this would be the kind of vehicle on that, that channel that would be declined for service because of its cleanliness. In fact, if you enjoy that kind of stuff, I'll go and leave a link in the description box below so you can see the kinds of things that mechanics see every day. This good. Boom. Boom. Hello. I just got pulled over last night. This is Ladybird. All good, Ladybird. All good, Ladybird. Is he gonna? Uh, no, I'm, I'm telling her you're all good. Okay. Um, I, can I reach in my glove compartment to get yeah, you the license plate? License um, yeah, uh, we'll, we'll get there. Um, we'll get there. Let me give you the license plate first so you can run the license plate and make sure it's not stolen. Um, it's, I was stopped last night by an officer just, just as I was going to my hotel. Um, and uh, here's the um, paperwork for getting the license plate. And that's an email and you can see the date. I got in an accident. Uh, I guess it was yesterday. Mm -hmm. And my license plate fell off. And I never had a front one. Um, yeah, I don't really buy that story too much, Softard. The, uh, I think the reason why is because, you know, uh, you're a sovereign citizen and you either don't have plates or you've got fake plates on. So either way, it's, uh, not so great for you. So I never had a front one. Yeah. And, uh, because the bumper changed a few years ago, but my, okay. my other one, I got in an accident last night. Um, Are you okay? There's yeah. No injuries? Okay. Uh, no, no, it was in Long Beach, and it was just I just tapped the bumper. Okay. Um, so uh, with the driver's license, I'm not driving. I'm traveling, so I'm not in that capacity. I'm more than happy. I do have the driver's license, and I'll give it to you um, so you can check my identity. I identity, yeah. but we both have to agree I'm traveling first. Okay. Or you can order me to do it, and you know, of course, I have well, to follow an order. License, so I know who I'm speaking to. Well. Um, as long as we agree that I'm traveling. Just, just let me see your driver's license. Right, uh, was that a yes or a no? I just need to see your driver's license. If no, I know, I, but if we're traveling, I can give you my name. I well, prefer because, to. Because you're on. I a, prefer you're, to give you my name yeah. if you want. Because you're on a public highway. Right. So I know. You know, state of Nevada, you got to have a driver's license. I do. To drive on I do right there. But I'm not. I'm not driving. Yeah. No, I don't mind at all as long as we agree that I'm traveling. Is that? You're driving at the moment. I'm not. I'm traveling. Okay. I'm not engaged in commercial capacity. So let me go ahead and uh, tell you my name and okay. date of birth. I know, but it's, spe it's 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 about spelling. It's about I want to spell my name correctly, and my my name is misspelled on my driver's license. Well, now he hasn't gone fully one hundred percent soft hard yet. He has a driver's license. He's, in other words, the lead paint chips that he's been consuming haven't completely melted his brain yet. Though you can tell the process is going to be starting because uh, he's going for the all caps argument. So at least we now know the paint chips will be taking their full course here shortly. But but if you have your driver's license, it'll be a lot easier. As long, but I'm traveling, so I do have my driver's license. It's actually right here. Um, um, he was just looking at it, Sorry, but um, I, I have a hard time hearing because all the traffic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, let me just write down my name and date, date of birth for you. Can no, I do it that I one? See your driver's license right there. You right. Know that one's expired. I had. I just got back from Walmart and I bought the beer, so I have a. Oh, yeah, I, have, I see it right there. Some blue moon. Yep. Yeah. And I got some water for the dogs, but. Yeah, I have my driver's license. This one's the same information, just expired. It's probably in my pocket, but I don't want to read. Okay, yeah, it's right here. Um, driver's license is right here, but I'm not driving, so I don't need a driver's license. I'm, I'm traveling. I'm not engaged in commercial use. 
I, 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 but here's, here's, here's the thing. This is in an all caps name, and I, okay. just, I just want to give you my name in not not all caps, upper no, and lower case. Because I know it's, it's jurisdiction, and you don't have it as I'm traveling, but I, I'm not an all caps name. I'm a man. Are you a man? Yes. Great. No man can order another man to do anything. And just where did you get that idea from? Considering, have you ever been in the military where men order men around all the damn time? Or for that matter, have you ever had a job? Because, you know, men get ordered around by men all the damn time. So you kind of got a really stupid argument there, along with everything else in your arsenal. So... Don't quit your day job if you actually have a day job. So, um, you know, if you order me, I'll give you the ID, or if we agree that we're traveling, or I can give you my name and date of birth. I That's what I'm willing to do. Yeah, I understand that, sir, but... I know it makes it easier, but all you gotta do is say, I'm traveling, uh, that we I'm agree to that. that. Then, yeah. yeah, this little word game of you trying to get the officer to admit that you're traveling, not exactly gonna work out too well right now. And uh, you still have to identify. Yeah. So um, because of that, it's in all caps name, and I don't. I'm not in all caps name. I'm a man, and I'm not engaged in commercial capacity. So I'm not going to give you the driver's license. If you need to ID me, you can um, run my name and date of birth. Again, I was pulled over last night. It was a five-minute stop. I understand that. And, uh, because I gave him the paperwork, and um, he agreed that we were traveling, and I showed him my I driver's license. Sir. I wonder if it was a rookie that you got a hold of that previous night. Because, you know, if you got a hold of a veteran officer, uh, yeah, that wouldn't work out too well on them. Because they would be able to see right straight through your soft, tarred garbage. They've seen it all. I know. You're, you're smart. You're smart. And you're very... You. And I'm, I am trying to, too. But this is my belief system. And this is my constitutional which, right. Which I understand. I'm, I'm so that, I'm that's all, all, that's all I'm trying to do. I'm not trying to be a dick. But uh, I want... I, you know, if, if, if you have to ID me... Sir, if, if you just hold it up like this, I won't take it from you. I'll just jot down your name and stuff like that. Just jot down my name spelled correctly. With a capital T and lowercase O and a, a lowercase M and a lowercase M and a, a lowercase well, Y. Can I make sure that it's valid at least? At least... Yeah. If, 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 uh, I, won't, I won't grab the There you go. There's, there's, there's two, it's okay. 2024. Okay. Can I just take down your driver's license number then? No, if because I'm not driving. You can, you can take my name and date of birth. Or you, we can, you know, like, or you can just order me to it and I'll send you a bill. But... Oh, he has a fee schedule. Well, of course he does. If he didn't have one, he wouldn't be a hilariously stupid soft tar to begin with. I mean, how much money are you going to charge per minute? Or for even one traffic stop? Would it be like this other one that I saw? 10,000 silver pieces? Or would it be something a bit more reasonable? Like, oh, $10 million dollars? For each traffic stop? Uh, I don't know. Inquiring minds want to know this stuff. Um, but so those, those are what I want to do. And that, that's just my belief system. That's just what I want. I'm not trying to be a dick or anything. It's just, to what, to it, it's, just, and it, it's just what I believe. That I we have rights that, that are protected and secured by the United States Constitution. And, um... Dude, your rights are being protected. It's just that you have this gross misinterpretation of what your rights or what you think your rights should be versus the reality of what they actually are. And you are not willing to meet where, uh, in the middle where they are actually at. Which is probably the reason why you have so much trouble with law enforcement because you know what? Your own ignorance tends to get the better of you. So, um, but I'm the registered owner. It's not, it's not stolen. And I know, I know you need the information. I know you need the information, but we're on the record with my, right. uh, you know, I'll phone. Just take, I'll just take the last name. What is it? It's capital R, lowercase o, lowercase c, lowercase k, and then lowercase s. Rocks. Rocks. First name. Uh, uppercase T, lowercase M, or low. Say again. Uppercase T, lowercase O, lowercase M. Say, say that one more time. Lowercase M. M. Lowercase M. M. And Sony. a lowercase Y. Yeah. Y. 
and we're on the record with me spelling it correctly, I, I feel comfortable. Um, okay, well, take a second, okay, Tommy? Just take your time. I'm not in any rush. I believe I'm not in the do not detain, also. Because my past two stops have been, have, uh, been real quick. And... and just where can we find this uh, magical do not detain list? I mean, yeah, uh, I don't think such a thing would even exist. At least outside of the mind of a soft heart, anyway. Tommy Rock, give me a second, all right? Take your time. And do you have insurance, Tommy? Yes, with AAA, I j just got an accident, and sh I, if I could dig around, yeah, I could around probably find it, like, in the back seat, because I pretty much checked the front. It was on here the last time I remember, and it was in two pieces. It's so on this vehicle, right, Tommy? Yes, I'm. it's a uh, Orb Nancy Green, my mom. Uh, but it, it is an Orb. So I have equal, okay. I have equal, uh, yeah. oh, I have, I have the auction that shows that right there. Yeah. Where's the boat at? What, what city? Uh, let's go with Rancho Santa Margarita and then they, uh. Um, oh, like California? Yeah, California. And then they drove it to my house. Oh, but, uh, okay. But yeah. see, I, I showed the officer that and he was so thrilled that I took the time to do that, that, you know, he, he let me go. Because, uh, I, like I, like I said, I do have, I, I I got in an accident, you know, um, it just happened, and the VIN is the same. Here's the, here's the, here's the issue, and, and if you want to get into the admissions, I mean, you're going you're gonna to find out what you're going to find out, but uh, it, it, it doesn't go anywhere. You know, it's, it, it's, just a civil, it's just a civil thing, but I can't register my car because there's an admissions recall, and I will not get... Oops. So I will not get the recall because it's going to make my car run crappy. So, uh, try to find your insurance for us. Mm -hmm. we'll it's, back. it's with we'll Auto Club. Back. Yep, okay. I'm not looking in the back seat. Uh, yeah, would you be able to find it in that mess? Because you know what, uh, I've seen the state of your car and it needs some work. Uh, yeah, you might you might roll up the window just a tiny bit. I don't want your dog to hop yep. out and touch to get hit by a car. Yep. Thank you. you Well, that's where the video ends, folks. I mean, there's any number of things that could have happened right here. He could have gotten arrested. He could have gotten his car towed. Any number of things could have happened right at this point because, you know, Savitars tend to cut off their video if they feel like they're about to get arrested just to make sure that their audience doesn't know that they're in the wrong. At any rate, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.